This heat might make anyone want to take a flying leap into a nice, cool pool. That's something just a short walk away for a long list of Tucson city pools, but some neighborhoods have no place to make a big splash. Their neighborhood pools are closed. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Guy Ashley. And I'm Stella Inger. A KGA 9 viewer asked us to learn why some pools are closed. Craig Smith has the answer. It is hot, it is dry, it's the perfect time for a refreshing dip in your neighborhood city pool. But in a lot of neighborhoods, those pools are simply closed and they'll stay closed all summer. The city has 20 neighborhood pools offering kids cool, wet refreshment for a dollar a dip. But seven others are closed, including Jesse Owens Pool, right where Mary Sullivan would like to bring her grandson Colton. She has Kega Nine on her side to find out why her neighborhood pool is closed. I feel really disgusted and, and just dismayed that we can't use our community pool that's for this neighborhood for my grandson. My kids grew up here and we used it all the time and there's no reason Tucson Parks and Rec has done this to this community. Parks says it's the budget. Aquatics alone cost about $2.6 million and staffing each pool costs forty to $60,000 a summer. The Parks Department says donations helped open more pools than when things were even worse. At one point it was 17 pools um, due to some campaigning, a summer splash campaign, we were able to raise some funds to open additional pools. One year it was four and then six and now it's been eight the past two years, an additional eight summer pools. So on top of the 10 pools we have open. The city keeps water in most of the closed pools to avoid deterioration. That's true of the Ori Park pool near I-10 in St. Mary's. It makes Grace Soto sad to see the pool she used growing up still and quiet. I miss it and I you know I have a little boy who's eight years old who would he, he passes by and he's like, Mom, you know, when is it going to open? When is it going to open? And I'm like, I have no idea when. City Park says it's trying to reopen the pools, but that will not happen this summer. Grace Soto and Mary Sullivan wonder why the city closed their neighborhood pools. The city says it's based on attendance and closeness to other city pools. But that is no consolation when they see locked gates on the pools they called home. Craig Smith, KGON 9, on your side.